It's been amazing and overwhelming the kind of interest that is generating. We have university students that want to get into more research. We have international organizations already flying into Nigeria to come and see this crazy idea coming out of Africa without power, without industry. And we are able to create something amazing out of our own mystery and out of our own bad situation. Oh, I'm mean selling like 10 bags per day when you know cool. But now, as when I get this thing now, I'm selling like 40 to 50 bags every day. Before I'm pining out before I will get it, but now I have a day. But now, customers they come at any time, even in the night, they are coming, come buy it. The rate at which um, the freezer uh, consume um, electricity is much higher. You understand what I'm saying? And even people that are using um, um, this um, pay as you go, uh, what do you say, meter, most of them don't use freezer. You get what I'm saying? You switch this freezer from, so if you can use a, solar on, um, a freezer on solar, at least it's going to reduce the cost of electricity. Mm, we have um, challenges because uh, the um, policies are not aligning, there, are no, there is no deliberate attention given to the sector to actually bring out the potential. There, there are no data. Government is actually not doing more to catalog or to profile those solutions that are actually impacting hundreds of thousands of lives. And I think in developed economy, these data are important to be able to help government to plan, to know where to channel support.